and it's not. There are other, he, he acts like there are not other races in this country. He acts like there's not other races around the world that created a lot of things that have a lot to do with the United States. He don't understand that. He don't even know the history of the United States. And that's the problem. When people don't know their own, the history of the United States, then you don't know the fuck you're talking about. Because Britain did not find the United States. Indians were here long before there were the British. So y'all keep saying the white men, but that's not who they are. <laughs> They're British. You're talking about the British. So you keep saying the white man, the white man, the white man. Do you know how many white people there are around the world? They're living in different countries. Can you be a little bit more specific? You're talking about the British. When you're dealing with the Jews, you're talking about the Germans. When you're dealing with people from uh, the Aussie, you're dealing with people from Australia, Swedish people from Sweden. You need to be specific. It's no different when you say Chinese people. Um, some of them are not Chinese. You have Japanese, you have Asian. So all in all, you just have Asian all the way around. But you also have Korea, Vietnamese. So you can't just sit up here and just say white people, Japanese, I mean, Asians, Hispanics. Because you have to understand that's not how it works. Not at all. Latinos and Mexicans are very different. Very different. Even though they speak the same language. Their cultures and food are very different. They're not the same. So that's why when Elijo says the white man, the white man, which one are you referring to? Which country? Because I'm confused. Are you talking about the British? Because the British still own the United States. I don't know why y'all don't believe that. The British still own the United States. They're the ones that make a lot of decisions all the way from across the waters. So y'all keep forgetting about that. That's in our history books. You're talking about the British. Point blank period. So when you're talking about racial people, you're talking about the British. Okay? You're not talking about other countries. You're talking about the British. Because the British are the ones that came and they ran out the Indians and took over this country of the of the United States of America, aka the north the northern uh, North America. <laughs> Say what is North America? So the British came and they took control over North America, and they still have control over North America today. Everybody think it's the Jews? No, it's North America. I don't care what you're talking about. The British took over North America. So that's who you're referring to. So understand, black people. You cannot just say white people. You need to be specific on who you're referring to. You have an issue with the British. You don't have an issue with anybody else. You got an issue with the British only. Because the British are the ones that own this country. Whether you like it or whether you don't. So you want to know who put you in slavery? That would be the British. talking you well, just the, missed it you just want her to talk more well Malia, at the end of the day hopefully you for your child now if your child is in a safe and i mean well i know you guys saying nothing in babylon is safe but if your child is in an okay situation and you've done it correctly and then say oh i'm going to get a cup of milk and, and never come back then that's fine um the the other situation i just thought that was kind of messy and Chief, I'm happy that you told her to go back and handle that because the way it was done was messy. You don't, you don't do, you don't leave babies like that. That's nah, like abandonment issues. Like that. Yeah, yeah I didn't know that. Yeah, so, so definitely. I mean, I'm gonna get off of all that, but it's, it's good.